An eighth person has died as a result of a grisly attack at a Georgia mobile home park. Investigators say seven people were found dead in a trailer at the park early Saturday morning, along with two survivors. One of those survivors died at a Georgia hospital Sunday. Georgia authorities say the man who reported the killings has not been ruled out as a suspect. Guy Hines Jr. was arrested late Saturday and is facing several charges, including drug possession and lying to police. Police say Hines told investigators that he came home and discovered the grisly scene, but they add that they don't know if he's responsible for the killings. The person or persons responsible for the, these deaths still remain unknown to us. I cannot tell you if they are at large or if they are not at large. I simply do not know. As they work to find possible suspects and a motive, they're asking residents to keep their eyes open for anything suspicious. Very likely, if not a certainty, that the person or persons involved with this have blood on them. So if you see a person walking around with blood, I'd call. If you come across any bloody clothing, call. Members of this typically quiet neighborhood say the possibility that the killer could still be on the loose has them on edge. I try and stay in. I lock my car if I'm the only one in the car, you know, and stuff like that. Meanwhile, the Georgia Bureau of Investigation has completed autopsies on several of the victims. More are scheduled to take place Monday. Ed Donahue, The Associated Press.